The Pontifical Biblical Institute is celebrating their 110th anniversary. It was founded by St. Pius X in 1909 and specializes in studying sacred scripture to promote biblical teaching and related studies in accordance with the spirit of the Catholic Church. Recently, they co-sponsored a conference called Jesus and the Pharisees, an interdisciplinary repraisal at the Pontifical Gregorian University in Rome. It has been examined the historical and popular interpretations of the meaning Pharisee, and how at times it has been used to derogatorily refer to Jews in general. So the need to sensitize people to who were the Pharisees, the connection between the Pharisaic tradition and the Jewish people today, and the connection between Jesus and the Pharisees of his time, and Paul who studied with Pharisaic teachers and the Pharisaic teachers who were constructive elements within if you like, the Christian story, all these things need to be properly understood in order to ensure that we don't fall victims to prejudices, stereotypes and misrepresentation. Rabbi David Rosen, Director of International Interreligious Affairs for the American Jewish Committee, notes how in the past popes have previously warned through church documents the misuse of terms and generalizations. He says Pope Francis has been important in promoting reconciliation between the Catholic Church and Jewish people and can help in further drawing attention to the stereotype use of the term Pharisee. The problem is not so much Pope Francis's use. The problem is, let's say, some priest in Bogota who says, well, the Pope talks like that about the Jews, why shouldn't I? And then applies it today in a prejudicial, negative manner. So to highlight this need to be sensitive, it's a really very important. During their three-day conference, Pope Francis met with them in the Vatican. In his prepared speech, he noted how the history of interpretation has fostered a negative image of the Pharisees, often without a concrete basis in the Gospel accounts. He hopes this study will further deepen a greater understanding of who exactly the Pharisees were.